Hey guys, Justin Bink here with Flipbook.org. So I think I'm about day, uh, almost about a month, a little under maybe, I'd have to check the dates again. Many, many a top, you know, little single, just these little shooters, but they're everywhere. And I topped one in the middle, and look at the difference, hold on, right here, one stop, for one branch, and it's got all those tops, just one, compared to the guys next to it, same size branch, same everything, but I didn't top it. And it covered, I mean, you can just imagine if you had this, right here, right there, 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 and 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 the rest of the canopy. Yes, so, topping in, uh, into flower, those were topped about a week into flower, um, and of course they'd already been uh, two inches above the screen, which is super important. And top, you can just see, you know what I mean? Well worth topping it. That's going to be just great right there. Of course, we'll block what's underneath, but trim it up. Trim it up really nice under there. I'm just going to have some serious uh, good nugs on here. I believe I'm about a, a month in. Uh, I can't remember. Uh, I kind of let the plant just tell me when it's done. Uh, you don't go by the numbers too much. A strict regimen of soap and water has completely uh, stopped all of the uh, mites. No mites anywhere, and it's just because soap and water every day, and it works. You just got to stay on it. How can they? How can they breed and develop all these? habitats and little ecosystems on your leaf if you're constantly uh, having floods and uh, tidal waves of soapy water coming through every day. It'd be impossible for bugs, for humans, for aliens. Looking good. Little update.